OK, do you want to be on croc duty and I'll drag the head? All right. OK. If the croc comes, push him away with that fork. <laughs> All right. He's also seeing his meal go away, so he's not going to be that happy. <laughs> oh, my god, look. <laughs> oh, there's maggots. We're not eating that, dude. <laughs> That is really gross. But actually, the tongue inside is going to be all right. It's just some maggots on the outside. OK, look, here, take that. OK, and then cut straight across this. <laughs> God, I don't want to hang around with this guy. Cut where? Straight across where the maggots are. Oh. Oh. Keep going, keep going, keep, keep, keep going. Oh. Oh. Surprisingly, it feels a lot like cutting a uh, tender piece of Kobe beef or something. That was really gross. Oh, dude, they moved, didn't it? Wow. Yeah, and it's pissed now. We just took away its tongue. The tongue is well protected from the heat, and actually is one of the last parts of the body that's going to rot. There's maggots everywhere else. We'll cook it out well later for dinner, and it'd be like a well-aged steak. He's grumbling at the moment, but he'll love it later. You got anything important in the little pouch? No, there? no, nothing. The thing I'm scared more of than being eaten by a leopard or falling to my death climbing a rock is some kind of harmful bacteria that my body's not used to because I'm not from this continent. This is exactly what I didn't want to do. <laughs>